My dear viewers, unless you are a member of the greatest generation, like the late Henry Kissinger, or a baby boomer, like Bill Clinton, you probably have a small house. These two generations were able to buy a large house before the economy began to go to hell during the 1973 oil crisis. If you live in a 1,300 square foot house like me, space is at a premium. I like to say the best gift I could receive is a free dumpster rental for a week. The next best gift would be a plane ticket and a hotel voucher for my wife scheduled for the same week. This way I can throw things out unhindered. I am at the age where I am googling senior housing that accepts pets just to see what is out there in a few years. I do not want more large material objects that I will not have room to take with me. I am also trying to figure out how I will talk loud to phone scammers, plus pound the floor with my feet to pretend I am climbing the stairs without getting thrown out by the apartment management. When it comes to the West Haven High School class of 1990, some of them have already died. Some of them are even becoming widows and widowers. I am very aware that I cannot take a material item to the grave or to the funeral urn. If you absolutely want to give me a gift that is not a dumpster rental, I like small things. Exterior disk drives and flash drives do not take up floor space. I can put them on the shelf. If you give me money, I can buy dividend stocks. The dividends can be a source of income when I am no longer able to work and I am living in senior housing. There are some German and Japanese dividend stocks out there where Robinhood will not let me buy fractional shares. I like the idea that the people my late older uncles fought during World War II would indirectly pay my family back with dividends. Thank you. Please like and subscribe. Thank you.